Hi, I am Valder Beebe. I am the host and the visionary of That Celebrity Interview. Thank you so much for joining us in Dallas, Texas, live on the Valder Beebe Show. Oh, it's my pleasure. Thanks for having well, me. Well, I really want to talk to you because my audience doesn't believe me when I say you're going to know. tell us about putting an end to robocalls, the epidemic that's currently occurring. You know, you're right. So many people feel just like so powerless, right? What can you do, right? My number's on the do not call list, right? I've told people not to call me back. I've pushed nine when they say it, and the calls just keep on coming. Yes. And they come one after another in a succession. They'll just change the last digit, and they'll call again. It is incredible. So what are we supposed to do? <laughs> it's true, and this problem doesn't seem to be going away. Uh, according to our data, over 43% of all calls in the United States are these illegal, unwanted robocalls. It's, it's unbelievable how big this problem has gotten. All right. So today's tax day. So you're getting calls from everything, from insurance to Medicare, to you name it, we're getting all kind of calls. Is there anything that we can do? We've got on, like you said, we are on the do not call list. I've been very polite. Take this number off your call list. It just doesn't matter. <laughs> exactly. Well, you got to remember that these guys are criminals, right? They're not telemarketers. I know that people give euphemisms and are polite and things, but no, like, you know, if you were getting robbed at gunpoint, you wouldn't be like, oh, sir, can you, uh, can you please put down the gun, right? Why don't we talk about this, right? No, no, that would not be the reaction. So you got to think of it, right? These guys, their job is to get you to part with your money. Okay. Well, what are we supposed to do? Because some of us are smart, and we're not parting with our money. That's and exactly. And I know they're the vulnerable and, and, and the susceptible, but most of us, no, you're not getting my money. That's exactly right. So even so, today, right, is, is tax day. We just made a new feed available to the carriers. We're giving it to them for free. It's basically all of the IRS callback scammers that we know about. Uh, we're going to be giving them to the carriers and hoping that they will immediately go and shut down any of those kinds of scammers. Uh, for consumers, right now, you can go and turn on Nomo Robo. Uh, it's available for free on landlines. It's available on all of the major VoIP carriers across the country. Or if you have the problem on your mobile phone, uh, grab our app. It has a two-week free trial. Um, and after that, it's only two bucks a month. So it's a small price to, uh, to pay to, to get rid of this, this annoyance and protect your phone and uh, you know, the phones of people that you love. It's a heavenly price to pay. We <laughs> don't mind that if we can it's just driving some people insane. It really is. And again, everybody kind of like jokes about it and like, right, they'll say that they, you know, sing songs to these people or waste their time or anything. But no, you know, at No More Robo, we see it every single day. We hear stories of people that have lost thousands and thousands of dollars and, and they'll call us up and say, is there any way for us to get the money back? And, uh, you know, the answer is unfortunately usually no, um, right? Protection is an ounce of, uh, ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure kind of thing. So we're just trying to get the, uh, the prevention message out there. Finally, you know, consumers aren't powerless anymore. Uh, grab technology like Nomo Robo and, and finally try and put an end to this, this epidemic. Aaron, you're the, Aaron Ross is the founder of No More Robo. Aaron, how did your company come about? Sure. Uh, a lot of people think that, like, you know, I was so overwhelmed with robocalls and I was going to find the answer or anything, but uh, it actually wasn't. A couple of years ago, the FTC had this robocall challenge, and they said uh, everything that they're doing uh, wasn't working uh, as well as it could, right? The, these are the, this is the, the, the part of the government that created the do not call list. Um, they put up a, a $50,000 prize to anybody who could kind of come up with a unique solution. Um, 800 people entered, and they picked, uh, they picked mine as the, the winner. I took that money and um, launched No More Robo with it. And last week, we passed the 1 billion robocalls blocked milestone. All right, then. Yeah. Oh, isn't America great? <laughs> yeah, right, exactly. And so many people say, like, oh, the government isn't doing enough. We need to. I think it's, it's the best kind of thing of the way that the government has been able to pull in private industry, right? We now have a big team that goes there. Our whole job is fighting robocalls. I love it. I love it. I love a success story also. I wish you the best. And I wish you can really, really stay on the job to help us. I said, because. we started uh, We started when I won the robocall uh, challenge, and uh, none of us at No More Robo are going to stop until the robocalls do. All right. Where can they find out more information about your company then? Uh, sure. Check us out online. It's at nomorobo.com, N-O-M-O-R-O-B-O.com. All the information is right there. I want to thank you so much, Aaron Ross, the founder of No More Robo. Y'all love that. You know you're going to love that. Thank you, Aaron. Hey, thank you. Take it easy. Hi, 
I'm Valder BB. I host the Valder BB Show, broadcast on radio and television. And this is my phone pouch. My phone pouch is a great invention. It allows me to go hands-free, pocket-free, purse-free, even belt-free. Head on over to myphonepouch.com.